Hey, how you doing? Good, good. Just, uh, um, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. Uh, wh- whenever I'm ready, right? Hold on, hold on. <clears throat> Never get comfortable in these things. <sighs> All right, Larry, welcome, welcome. Uh, we're looking forward to hearing a little bit of hot fire tonight. Hope you're, uh, hope you're well. Yeah, yeah, got it right here. Okay, whenever you're ready, uh, we're rolling. Take it away. Yeah, here it is. Story of my life. My life. I'm reading it first before Margaret has a chance to steal it from me. I'm telling you, I'm telling you, and I'm telling you. These are selections from Hot Fire by me, Professor Larry Donner, launching season four of the Stories Telling Stories podcast. Here we go. How do you like me now, Margaret? <clears throat> Chapter one. The night was... The night... The night was... What am I doing? All you gotta do is read the words, Larry. You've been through this. You wrote the damn book. It's a brilliant book. It's a book of your life. So why, why can't you read the words? Okay. Do it. Just read the words, Larry. Open your mouth. Read the damn words. It's not so hard. They're just words. Come on. Sorry, sorry. Uh, The night was... Oh, but are they the right words? Oh, Jesus, not this again. God, you're like Choo Choo Charlie all over again trying to get up that damn hill. (sighs) The night was hot. Wait, no. The night. The night was humid. The night was humid. No, wait. Hot. Hot. Ha <laughs> ha. The night was hot. Wet and hot. Hot and wet. The night was wet and hot. Hot and wet. That's humid. The, the, the night was humid. <sighs> maybe the night wasn't humid. Maybe. Maybe the night isn't humid. Maybe it was, it was humid in the morning, and at night it was cold. That gives you fog. Ha! The night was foggy. <sighs> Come on, Larry. Why are you doing this to yourself? Again, you stay Javu and Sisyphus pushing a stupid rock up an endless hill. Why? Why? Why are you doing this again? Just get through it. Get through it, Larry. Then you can go visit Anne and you can forget all about this stupid podcast. What was that? Nothing. Nothing. Uh, okay. <clears throat> Here we go. Hot Fire by Larry Donner. <clears throat> the night... The night was, the night was, the night, the night was dry, yet it was raining. Easy there, Larry. The the streets were wet, but the night was as bright as the earrings in Margaret Donner's ears. My God, I'm going out of my mind. Uh, Larry, we gotta get this episode out for the patrons, so... If you can put the existential crisis on hold and get through the reading, we'd really appreciate it. Um, we know you're stressed out. Oh, but, oh, 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 I'm stressed out. Thank you very much, Mr. Producer, but I'm fine. I'm fine. <laughs> I'm not stressed out. There's nothing to be stressed out about. I wrote the book, you see. I wrote the book. It's my book. My book. I wrote it. Hot Fire by Professor Larry Donner. The original, the OG, the number one, the story of my life. You can't tell me how to read the story of my life. I wasn't trying. <laughs> this is how you run your operation. I can see why you're doing so well. Look at this. Milthouse Studios. What kind of armchair quarterback production company is this? Do ply toilet paper in the bathroom, folks. Costco special. I was legitimately surprised. You got listeners in, 11, in 91 different countries and you can Come barely on, keep the lights that's on. That's really not necessary. <laughs> hey, can I read my book? Go ahead. Go right ahead, Larry. We're still rolling. I'm not you keep stop interrupting me, and, and I can't concentrate. Book. I won't say another I haven't even word. got to pass the first sentence because this place was not built with the artist in mind. Oh yeah, you got a nice microphone, sure, but the furniture, the isolation, the beverage selection. You got to step up your game if you hope to get any new patrons or gain any sort of traction in season four. Come on, Larry. Okay, I think that's I'm about going. enough. I'm reading now. <clears throat> Chapter one. 
the night was... And now you got me in the entirely wrong headspace. Oh, come on. Headspace is important. I may have written these words already, but reading and writing are two completely different disciplines, and I don't think you understand that. I think there's a lot of things you don't understand, and the people out there need to hear it. You hear that, folks? The ship is sinking. You're better off jumping overboard like Margaret chasing her earrings, or you're going to be lost at sea like Gilligan and the Skipper. But unlike Margaret and these STS clowns, at least I can write. This may be a tad bit disturbing, but uh, we've just signed your wife on to read in a future season premiere. Get me a doctor, Eric. I'm having a heart attack. The book sold two million copies. But I wrote that! And you know that. Margaret couldn't write her name in the snow. Larry, I've given you the opportunity to tell your story first. But here we are, excuse after excuse as to why you can't tell your story. You told me it was done. You told me it was finished. But the only thing that's apparent right now is that you never wrote the book. I never wrote the book? <laughs> I never We've wrote Hot Fire. all day, and I haven't even heard the first sentence of this legendary Larry Donner penned version of Hot Fire. That's what you want? I want you to read Hot Fire. That, that's what'll give this little show a million listeners? A single sentence? You want a complete sentence, Eric? Fine. Fine. I'll give you a sentence. You want this monkey to dance for his bread? I'll dance. Here you go. You think I'm lying? Here's one complete sentence for you. Fuck it. The night was... Human. Ugh. That's it, and that's all. Thank you very much. I'm leaving. I have a massive headache in my eye. Uh, I guess that's a wrap. Welcome to season four of Stories Telling Stories, folks. I'm glad you're here. Coming up in season four, we're going to continue our Locked in Vacancy series telling stories of solitude and isolation as the pandemic continues to lock down the planet in 2021. We've also got a new series starting up called A Writer Writes that's supposedly hosted by Professor Donner, where we sit down with up-and-coming and amateur writers to talk about their craft and share some of their stories, like a podcast version of Professor Donner's creative writing class. And we've got a mountain of classic STS pop culture stories from TV, movies, video games, and books to get to. So you've got plenty to look forward to. As always, if you'd like to support the show, we've got a Patreon page with early access materials, behind-the-scenes snippets from the mind of the producer, and more starting at a dollar a month or more. We've also got a Facebook and Instagram page if you're into that sort of stuff. And I know Season 3 didn't end as intended, but life sort of got in the way family had to come first. I hope you're excited for everything we've got in store for 2021. And until next time, stay sane, stay safe, and stay whimsical.